everybody to the second battle of the 2023 Pokemon Showdown Championship Tournament. Tonight we have got Tag Force versus Blue Cat. Both these guys have brought some pretty exciting looking teams. Tag Force, you guys probably know if you've watched the previous years, he's been in every tournament up until now. Blue Cat, though, is new for us this year. So let's head down to the pitch and talk to our battlers tonight. Blue Cat, how are you doing? I'm doing good. Looking forward to this battle. Yeah, yeah. Uh, anything you want to say to Tag before we get started? Uh, good luck. You'll need it. <laughs> All right, Tag, how are you doing? I'm doing great. You know, yeah. oh, four, it's been, three years it has been going, have it been uh, going well? But this year, I'm feeling it. I feel a change. All right. Anything you change. want to say to Blue Cat before we start? I hope you packed enough revives, because that's how because that's how you're gonna be leaving here. <laughs> <laughs> Needing a revive, yeah. All right. Well, if we are all ready, then let's go ahead and get started. Three, two, one, begin. And here we go. All right, Blue Cat's leading with the Archaeops, Tag Force leading with the Galvancer. Tag, I think I'm getting a bit of an echo from you. Sorry about that. How's right. that? Let's see what these guys do with their leads. I've seen Tag use the Galvantula before. That's one of my favorites as a bug type leader. And then the Archaeops, that's an interesting choice. Okay, it's going for the acrobatics. The Galvantula's gonna hold on with the focus sash, gonna land a thunder, and it's gonna one shot the Archaeops with Tag getting the first KO of the match. That focus sash really helped him out there. Alright, let's see how Blue Cat responds. Yeah, Galvantula and Thunder with that compound eyes boost, that is a that is a force to be reckoned with. Alright. Blue Cat's leading with the superior, got the superior out now. Let's see what she is gonna do with that. Now let's see if Tag wants to keep out his Galvantula or pull it back. Uh, the Leaf Storm is going to miss. Tag Force is going to go for the Bug Buzz. That's going to do a ton of damage to the Superior. Unfortunate miss on that Leaf Storm, but it is very good that the Superior held on there. I thought that Bug Buzz might have claimed it, but not quite yet. And there's the Hidden Power. That's going to go ahead and take out the Galvantula. Survived long enough to get a revenge kill for that Archaeops. All right, now both our battlers are down one Pokemon. Let's see what Tag sends out. He's going with the Hound Doom. All right, now without its Mega Evolution, Houndoom is not quite as strong as it usually is. But okay, now Blue Cat's gonna switch for the Toxapex and it is going to. Wow, that was a ton of damage for a flamethrower. Still, the Toxapex took it pretty well. It is holding out. Tag still getting an echo from you. My bad. Now, Toxapex, we've seen Toxapex get used in the last couple of years. It is a very, very strong wall. So let's see what Tag wants to do about that. I like that it's pink. I didn't know. Okay, he's going to go for the Age of Slash. And there's a Scald. We're going to get the burn. Oh, we do get the burn. That's not going to be good for the Age of Slash. All right, let's see what Tag does next to counter that. There's a lot of things that an Age of Slash could be doing. Not sure what he's going to go for on it. He's going to go for the King Shield, and <laughs> they're both going to try to bunker up. <laughs> Nothing happens except for a little bit of chip, da chip damage on the Age of Slash. Okay, he's going for the Sword Stance. Toxapex is going to recover. So if he's going for the Sword Stance, that's a good attack boost. Is it enough to offset the burn? We're going to find out here, I think, pretty soon. We're going to find out. But Toxapex is back to full health. Okay, he's go yep, he's going for an attacking move. There's a Sacred Sword that does nothing at all. And there's another Scald that is going to put a pretty big dent. And there's the Burn Chip chipping down the Age of Slash. God, that, <laughs> that Toxapex. It's scary, man. Whenever I go up against it, I'm always confused on what to do. Okay, he's going to go for the Decidueye. He's going to pull that out. There's another Scald to get the Burn. Yes, there is a Burn. But the Lumberry's going to cure it. That's good for Tag right now. That is good to get rid of that burn. Now, let's see. This is a version of Decidueye that I am not entirely familiar with. 
I haven't seen it before. So, okay, it's going to go for the Leaf Blade. Nice crit. Big dent on the Toxapex. The Toxapex is going to get off the Toxic, though, and that's going to start chipping away at the Decidueye. Is still a ton of damage from that Leaf Blade onto that Toxapex. Is this what Tag needs to crack it? We'll see. There's a Baneful Bunker that's going to protect against that next Leaf Blade. Now, sometimes Baneful Bunker can poison, but... Looks, he's already poisoned, so that's not going to matter. He's going to go for the Sword Stance. It's a plus two attack. Toxapex is going to recover right back to full health. Right back to full health. Let's see what this... Ne okay, there's another Baneful Bunker. And yep, completely protected from that Leaf Blade. And then that Toxic Poison is getting stronger. Now, the question is, will Tag keep out that Decidueye, or will he switch it for something else and try to bring it back out later? Let's see. Blue Cat's holding a very strong defensive position. He needs to crack this Toxapex. I can tell they're thinking very carefully about their next move. He's going to bring in the Noivern instead. And there's the Superior. Both of them have switched out of that stalemate. Now we got a Noivern out. I love me a good Noivern. Tried to use it before, so let's see how Tag does with it. That Superior is... And now he's going to get the U-turn. That's going to take out the Superior... Let's see who he throws in. Instead, he's going to go for the Pre-Marina. Blue Cat is now down two Pokemon. So let's see who she sends out next. He's going to go back for the Toxapex. That's a pretty strong check there. Let's see what Tag does about it. There's a Psychic! Big damage to the Toxapex. The Toxapex is going to get that Toxic off, though. Still, that was a huge dent, that super effective Psychic attack. There's the Baneful Bunker. It's going to get protected, and that Toxic is going to start chipping away right at that at that pre-marina there. So let's see. Nope, Blue Cat's going to bring out the Alakazam instead. There's a Psychic, and the Resist eats it pretty well. Good switch by Blue Cat. There's a burn. So that Alakazam must be holding a Flame Orb. Let's see what, he, what she's going to do with that. Tag's going to bring out the Houndoom now. There's a nasty plot. Alakazam getting that big special attack boost that ain't good still though tag's got a dark type out that does give him the type advantage so let's see what happens next turn that burn is gonna start wait does alakazam get magic guard doesn't matter there's the toxapex and the dark pulse does a big hit against that toxapex it's still holding in there it does get magic guard okay i couldn't remember thank you dry guy all right. Big, big, big dent into that Toxapex now. Dra uh, Tag is definitely starting to push into Blue Cat's defenses. And he's anticipated the toy, the poison. God, I can't talk tonight. What is up with that? He's anticipated the poison. And there was an absolute whiff there. Big psych damage chunk out of Alakazam there. But the Toxic is definitely starting to put in some work on Tag's pre-marina. It's not going to have any more than a few turns left in it. He's going to swap it back out for the Houndoom. Checking that Alakazam, it's going to resist the heck out of that Shadow Ball. Now, Tag getting to force out that Alakazam was really good for him, losing that nasty plot attack boost. Without it, I think that Shadow... With it, I think that Shadow Ball would have done a lot more damage. So good on Tag for forcing out that stat switch. Now, let's see if he's going to keep his momentum or if Blue Cat's going to switch Mons or pull out something else. Let's see. They're thinking very carefully about it. Okay, she's going to bring the Toxapex back out. Dark Pulse, again, does a bit of damage. Big bit of damage there. That Houndoom is really giving Blue Cat some trouble. Let's see what she wants to do to counter it. We still haven't seen... Yep, okay. There's the Iron Valiant. I was going to say we hadn't seen some of her mons yet. We haven't seen the Volcarona, and now we've seen the Iron Valiant, but that switch did, did give Tag a window, and now he's got that special attack boost, so let's see what Blue Cat's going to answer that with. We are on turn 26, and this battle is moving very slow. It's very tense. Both battlers are really... Okay, the Pre Marine is back out. There's an Aura Sphere. Nice switch by Tag. Completely ate that Aura Sphere. That was a great resist. All right, let's see what he does in response. 
There's an X Scissor, and it is still gonna resist it. There's a Psychic, and it one shots the Iron Valiant. Iron Valiant's out, and that Pre Marine is just barely hanging in there with 2% health. Tag is knocked out, three Mons so far. Now, Blue Cat is. Blue Cat hasn't fainted many of Tag's Mons yet, but she is pushing into the ropes. Still got that Toxapex in her back pocket. And we are about to see the Pre Marine go down. There it goes for Blue Cat's second KO this match, playing a long game with the Toxic. Nice work. All right, let's see who Tag sends out. He's going to go with the Decidueye, who is also poisoned. Toxapex against Decidueye. Matchup I haven't seen before. What's the new Titan on that? He's uh, Grass Fighting. Okay, this is going to go with a Volcarona, and that is going to quad resist the Leaf Blade. For a quad resist, 17% damage was not bad. Okay. Still, though, now Blue Cat's got the type advantage. Tag knows that he's going to switch for the Hound Doom. Volcarona's got the Quiver Dance off. Tag is going to have to do something about that real quick. Everyone here knows how devastating a Volcarona with one Quiver Dance can be. Let's see what he does. There's a signal beam. That is going to take out the Hound Doom. Tag Force is going to have to throw something up really strong against this Volcarona to halt Blue Cat's advance. He's got some mo momentum now. Okay, there's the Noivern. Noivern does have a good type advantage against Volcarona. So let's see what Tag does with that. We haven't really seen him use it too much outside of that one U-turn. It's very fast, too. The question is, can it outspeed a plus one Volcarona? Volcarona is also pretty fast. I guess it's going to depend on how invested these guys are. Let's see. No, Blue Cat's not risking it. She's taking the Toxapex. There's a Hurricane ton of damage to the Toxapex there. Blue Cat's got to be really careful with that Toxapex. Without it, she's losing a lot of defensive ability against Tag. But so far, she's done a really good job of holding it in with those recovers. Tag's going to bring out the Age of Slash, and that's going to waste the Baneful Bunker right there. Still, that Age of Slash is burned. Tag's going to have to do something pretty dramatic with it if he hopes to get any use out of it before it goes down. So let's see. We're three on three now. Turn 34. This is a really tense match. I have no idea which way it's going to go. It definitely isn't quick and decisive like the last one. These guys are very, very carefully thinking about their moves. You love to see it. We're getting to a very, I think, a, a big tipping point in the match here. It's probably going to be decided in the next few moves. Okay, Tag's going to go for the attack. and go for the Shadow Sneak, but it doesn't do anything. And that Scald is going to take out the Age of Slash. Yeah, that burn having its attack damage was just too much. But he's still got the Decidueye and the Noivern. Now let's see if one of these can take out that Toxapex. Okay, she's going to bring out the Volcarona again. There's a knockoff ton of damage! And losing the Focus Sash. Not that the Focus Sash would have helped much, but now that Volcarona is really weak, and if Blue Cat can't get off another Quiver Dance, that Volcarona might be in trouble. So let's see what happens next. That Decidueye is putting in a lot more work than I... Okay, no, she's going to go for the rest. And... There's another knockoff, but without that item to lose, it's not doing as much damage. The Toxic is chipping away at the Decidueye, but the Volcarona was not packing a berry, so it is asleep now, giving Tag some time to maneuver. The question is, what's he going to do with it? Let's see. He's got maybe one turn left in that. Okay, no, the Toxapex is back out. We're going to go... There's the triple arrows. It's a crit, but it is a resist. And there goes the Decidueye. Tags, all he's got left now is that Noivern. Now, it is fully healthy. It's not poisoned. It's not burned. And it could still be packing a couple of powerful moves. So let's see what he's going to do with it. No, the Volcarona's going to come back out. It's still asleep. He's going to hurricane it and takes out the Volcarona. We've got sacked the Volcaronas, brought out the Alkazam. The Alkazam is still burned. This might come down to whoever's faster. Because Alakazam is also a pretty speedy bond. Question is where... No, the Hurricane misses! That's not good! There's a Psychic attack, and the Noivern takes over half damage. That was very unlucky miss from the Hurricane there. No, there's... And he's going to take out the Alakazam! It's all down! It's one-on-one -on -one now. It's down to Noivern and Toxapex. Now, if Noivern can break this Toxapex, that's Tag's game in the bag for him. 
I'm on the edge of my seat here. It's all- Oh, the hurricane misses! That's not good! There's a Toxic putting that Noivern on a timer, but hasn't fainted it yet. That gives Tag just a couple more chances. Nope, there's a Baneful Bunker. That's gonna hurt. But that Baneful Bunker might not work twice in a row. There's the Hurricane! It didn't do enough damage. There's the Recover. And that Toxic is gonna... 1%. If he can get, if he can get, nope, there's the Baneful Bunker. It's going to deflect it, and the Noivern is going to get poisoned and go down, giving Blue Cat the match. Well done, guys. Great match. Good game. Good game. I thought I had you, but you can't hide behind that Toxic. I got really lucky with the misses at the end. If you hit me, you probably would have won.